Garza will want to hear from you ASAP, and we've got a ship to catch. Take care of yourself, okay? Stay safe out there. So long. Lieutenant, I was just speaking with Sergeant Jackso. Congratulations. Saving Senator Krasel will certainly help our affairs with the Senate. We needed someone to owe us a favor. Well done. I just did my job. You've accomplished something very important. Something beyond even your assignment to hunt down Tavis and the other traitors. You are in the field, Lieutenant. You see how far the Empire is reaching. A full attack isn't far off now. To keep the Empire's forces at bay, we need the Senate's support. We need allies. I'm glad I could help out the cause. Yes, you've done quite well in that regard. One thing, Lieutenant. I was disappointed to learn of Wraith's escape. She's capable of causing great turmoil. Catching Wraith would have meant leaving Krasul to die. Then you probably made the best choice. The Senator is certainly more useful alive than dead. Now, our technicians have decoded the first two sets of data from the Coruscant Relay. Your first two targets are Taris and Nar Shada. Can you tell me anything beyond the destinations? Not at this time, I'm afraid. I'll try to collect more intelligence and give you a fuller briefing when you arrive at each location. Good luck, Garza out. Come in, Lieutenant. This is General Garza. Do you copy? I read you loud and clear, General. I understand you've just landed on Taris. I've already contacted our local regimental commander, Colonel Gaff, to secure his support. Colonel Gaff doesn't know the specifics of your mission, only that he should assist you in every way possible. I'd like to keep it that way. I'll keep quiet on the details, General. That's for the best, Lieutenant. Taris is a dangerous and untamed wasteland. A Sith attack several centuries ago leveled every standing structure and virtually eradicated the local population. Where cities once rivaled Coruscant, only swamps and ruins remain. Reclaiming and rebuilding the planet has become an important symbolic goal for the Senate. Can you give me any more intel on the area? I see vague mention of infectious parasites. Apparently, Colonel Gaff works hard to withhold negative information about the reconstruction. That's all I have for you, Lieutenant. Report in when your operation is complete. I'll contact you as soon as the job is done, General. Well, well. General Garza graces us with her finest. At ease. I'm Colonel Gaff. These are my senior officers. Your CO sent orders to do whatever is necessary to support your mission. Of course, she didn't see fit to tell me what that mission is. You care to enlighten me? I can't discuss the details. Typical. Forget the reconstruction of Taris, I gotta shift everything around and help with some top secret mission nonsense. Whatever Garza has you looking for, you won't find it on Taris. Nothing unusual has happened since I took command. Patrol teams 3, 5, and 8. All lost, or without explanation. Sergeant Dorn, I don't recall giving you permission to speak. I wasn't speaking to you. I was speaking to the Lieutenant, per General Garza's instructions. Are you ordering me to violate Code 73B and ignore the General's directive, Colonel? Always got a regulation to quote, don't you, Sergeant Dorn? If the Sergeant has information, I'll take it. The matter was settled days ago. Taris is dangerous. Casualties are common on patrol teams. It's unfortunate, but not unusual, no matter what Sergeant Dorn says. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got a planet to run. Carry on with your secret mission. Just. Don't muck up anything important. Apologies for the Colonel, Lieutenant. Not all men are meant to lead. Colonel Gaff is disobeying a direct order. I can assure you it's not the first time he's done so. I'm Ilara Dorn, sir. Sergeant, First Class, Commander of Search and Rescue Squad 204. We have three full squads, all MIA on patrols. The situation is critical. What makes you say that? Eighteen unexplained casualties over two weeks. Regulations call for a battalion-level investigation, but nothing has been done. Casualties are common on swamp patrols. 
Rakugul attacks account for the majority, approximately 87%. However, SAR sweeps discovered no evidence of Rakugul activity in these instances. Someone else attacked those teams. If you're looking for unusual activity, then this is it, sir. What exactly is a rat ghoul anyway? Rat ghouls are disease-carrying mutants. Rat ghoul bites and scratches are infectious. Those infected become rat ghouls themselves in 6 to 48 hours. I included the last known coordinates for the MIA patrols in my official incident report, Lieutenant. I'll load it into your datapad for your review. Taurus falls under unexplored, unsecured territory protocols. All armor cams transmit to SAR command. I'll contact you with developments. Sounds like a plan, Sergeant. Good luck, Lieutenant. That was... interesting. I've had drill instructors more relaxed than that woman. Not to mention that accent. What do you mean? What's unusual about her accent? The only people I've heard talk like that were Imperials. The Republic must have freed her homeworld in the war. Growing up Imp would explain a lot about her personality. I'd say the Republic could use more officers like Dorn. And I'd say there's a better use for a soldier's time than memorizing every single regulation in the books. Guess it's off to work then. I'll watch our backs. Those are power converters, Lieutenant. Old ones. Any theories on how they got to that location? I was hoping you could tell me. Power converters come from ignition systems, engine parts. It takes work to remove them. Someone dropped these converters. Either the patrol or their attackers. We need more information to determine which. Guess I'd better find more information. I'll remain in contact, Lieutenant. Dawn out. More power converters. According to the logs, this patrol followed an entirely different route. Either both patrols recovered the same engine parts from separate locations, or the converters were dropped in both areas by one group. The attackers. This could all just be a coincidence. The odds would be astronomical, Lieutenant. We're past that point now. A specialist MO7 science officer could examine the converters to determine their source. We have such an officer on staff. I will notify him while you search the last coordinates. Sounds like a plan, Sergeant. Very well, Lieutenant. I'll proceed to Science Division at once. Good luck, Lieutenant. Lieutenant, status report. Are you injured? Everything is fully operational. Good. There's much to do. Your attackers were scavengers. Threat assessment reports classify them as a non-combatant group. That classification is clearly inaccurate. I'll notify command. I need to know where these scavengers come from, their numbers, and armaments. Unknown, sir. Local intelligence felt they weren't worthy of investigation. Armed hostility against Republic personnel clearly justifies an immediate armed response, Lieutenant. It's your call. Do we have any leads on the Scavenger's HQ? Orbital Scan has just managed to pinpoint the location of the Scavenger's compound. I'll scramble up my team and prep them immediately. We'll effect entry to the compound once you've created an opening. See you on the other side, Sergeant. Good luck, Lieutenant. Sergeant Dawn out. <laughs> 